Now, here's the part where there's wisdom in the excuse me, where there's wisdom in the Bible. I'm talking about Matthew's uh, chapter 4. Now, this is profound wisdom because Jesus, you know, well, we know his name, you know, wasn't Jesus. But Esau, we're going to say Esau, that's one name they called him, which is better suited for those times. But for these times, it's Jesus, which stands for justice. Now, this is talking about the whole entire black nation. Brown, black, brown, red, yellow. Because it's, it's these uh, people's uh, homeland is getting invaded by the Caucasoid right now. Venezuela, you know. So, if it's not black, brown, it's the uh, Arabs, so-called Arabs. That's uh, got the oil, and over in uh, Africa, Somalia, they fighting over there. And this is what I want y'all to understand before we uh, get off into the state. Of national emergency, the R Rex uh, 84 and aka King Alpha Plan. Matthew's The Temptations of Christ. His name wasn't Jesus Christ, but we're not gonna get it because we're wasting time fighting over, uh, you know semantics and wordplay and whatever. Then chapter 4 says, and, and then Jesus was led up of the Spirit into the wilderness to be tempted of the devil. Now let's turn it around and say, and Jesus was led up of the Spirit into the wilderness of North America. To be tempted by the devil. See, that's why you got all these brothers selling out. They was tempted, and they couldn't. They couldn't hang out. They couldn't hang. You know, they they gave in too quick. And these brothers, some of these brothers, fast and pray and say Allah a hundred times and. But they were weak, and they sold out. And, and when he had fasted 40 days and 40 nights, he was afterward hungry, hungry. Now, he was hungry, so he was at a vulnerable point because he fasted for 40 days and 40 nights. But his spirit... Or his uh, vibration was on a higher frequency, though. And so the devil wanted to try him. And when the tempter came to him and said, If thou be the Son of God, command that these stones be made bread. You know. <laughs> In other words, perform a miracle. You know, I know you're hungry. Perform a miracle. And when the tempter came to him and said, If thou be the Son of God, command these stones 
be made bread. But check this out. But he answered and said, It is written, man shall not live by bread alone, but by every word that proceeds out of the mouth of God. Let's say that, say that bread is talking about cash money. We call, we call money bread, cheddar, like food, you know. But you can't eat money, cash money. You could eat, you could actually eat bread, though. And Jesus said, thou shalt not live by bread alone. Well, you can't live by money alone. Because you can't eat money. <laughs> you know? And uh, sometimes, you know, you just can't sit up there and be a glutton and eat food all, all the time. Satisfy your, your uh, appetite. So... I'm not going to read the whole thing, but I'm trying to get you to see that only the strong survive. I'm not talking about muscles. I'm talking about mentally and spiritually. Only the strong survive. You know, uh, the devil was tempting Jesus, he wanted to give him, if you bow down to me, I'm going to give you the whole planet, the whole world, my world. And justice didn't bow down to him. Now, that's the ideal uh, scenario. But we, we, the black man is justice. On the planet earth. He's Jesus. The black man. He's the only one. That can give justice. To everybody. Black. Brown. Red. Yellow. And white. Or even Caucasian. He's the only one. That is capable of doing that. But. His will, so far, can dominate the will of the devil, or the tempter. The devil's will is being done. Not God's will will be done, but the devil's will is being done. Because the only reason why we are being gullible and fooled and being a sucker is because we are, we are afraid to face reality. Now... Even though we don't have the weapons that he has, the arsenal that he has, we got the mental capacity more capable of creating uh, a solution for this for this devil's madness and. They brought us the example of that, the, the Honorable Elijah Muhammad. In the midst of his enemies, he overcame. He did his will. He did God's will, not the devil's will. He did God's will until he left away, until he left the planet. And he was blessed with richness. And his people was blessed with richness. The only thing is, they were followers like the 12 disciples. Judas was in that mix. And the rest of them, when the cock uh, crowed, what did he say? Uh, You're going to deny me when the cock crowed three times. And all the, all the nation denied after the messenger died. And Wallace came and Farrakhan came. They denied the messenger, and the whole damn near nation denied the, the messenger and they fell apart, didn't know what to do with themselves. That's right. See, the <clears throat> now they want to tell you don't read the Bible 
in the Quran and all like that. No. If you don't know how to read it, don't read it. Because it's only going to confuse you. But if you got a determination to get wisdom out that Bible and out that Quran, Torah, and all the other holy books, scriptures that they got, you got to have a pure heart and a strong desire to get, to get revelations. Go between the lines, read between the lines, and get the true message. Because see, it's already in you anyway. So it's like a, a frequency in the book that taps into the frequency or the vibration that's in your soul or your, or your mind. And you will get a revelation like all the rest of the prophets. And will show you how to be. So let's turn to a situation where Goliath. You know, the big bully Goliath and the little dude, David. David defeated the giant with a sling shot. He didn't have on no armor, no, so, no uh, arsenal like the giant. The giant had an army backing him up, plus with uh, weapons of mass destruction. He was overconfident, the giant was. So he let David do his thing first. He said, go, go for what you know, Dave. Daoud. Daoud did his thing and took the devil's head. He cut his head off, man. After he hit him in the head, you know, with a smooth stone. He cut his head off with the sword. Black light. 